So again, a quick run rundown of how you're doing your narration for your bird documentary and iMovie. So the first thing is you'd want to make sure that you have all of your questions done on your bird documentary movie timeline document. You have six questions about the name of your bird, the habitat, what's your bird, what does your bird eat. Uh, there's six questions up here at the top you would need to make sure that you have answered. This is basically your script. The bottom part of the document, this is just a chart telling you what you're basically talking about for each segment. So the title screen, you're given the name of your bird, which is just question one. Your second segment of the iMovie, the image of your bird and your habitat, the green screen effect, you describe the habitat and what your bird eats, which is what you answered in number two and number three. So you wanna make sure that you have this part done first before you're trying to record an iMovie. Now let's go ahead over to iMovie. I'm gonna switch and go over to my iMovie project. Here's my title screen with the name of my bird. So that's all set. Now I go to basically segment number two, which if I go back to my document, segment two in iMovie I have right here the image of my bird, my habitat, I need to describe the habitat and what the bird eats. So right here, I've got what my habitat is and what my bird eats. That is what I need to record for my narration in iMovie. So I go ahead and I switch back over. I wanna be at the beginning of that clip, of that segment. I'm gonna go over here to the microphone. I'm gonna tap on the microphone. It'll get set ready to record. I'll just tap record and it'll do a little countdown and then it'll start recording in my segment. So I'll go ahead and do that here. My bird lives in a swamp marsh. Uh, the swamp, swamp marshland is very, very muddy, has a lot of plants that help to filter through the water. Since my bird lives in the swamp marsh, it eats a lot of mollusks and invertebrates, along with also some insects. I tap stop. Here's my recording showing up in my timeline. I go ahead and I click accept. I would want to play it back to hear how my recording is to make sure that it's... My bird lives in a swamp. Okay, so I know that my microphone worked. It's all set, ready to go. Now, the one thing that you'll see is that here in my timeline, my narration does not last as long as my recording. So what I can do is I can tap on the main part of my project timeline. Now I don't wanna tap on the, the green screen, but down here. And what I can then do is I can go and I can tap, I can go and tap and drag on either end to cut this down to match with my narration.